Good morning. This is All India Radio Kohima. The morning news read by Jonas Yantan. Defence Research and Development Organisation, DRDO, and Directorate of Defence Research and Development, DDRND, Ministry of Defence Israel, have entered into a bilateral innovation agreement to promote innovation and accelerate research and development in startups and MSMEs for the development of dual-use technologies. The agreement was signed in New Delhi yesterday. The Ministry of Defence in a statement said that under the agreement, startups and industries of both countries will work together to bring out next-generation technologies and products in the areas such as drones, robotics, artificial intelligence, quantum technology, photonics, energy storage and natural language processing. The development efforts will be jointly funded by DRDO and ddr and d Israel. Union Minister for Commerce and Industries, Biyush Kuyal, said that India is poised to achieve services export target of $1 trillion by 2030. He was addressing the Global Services Conclave 2021 in New Delhi yesterday. The minister said that in 2020, India became the seventh largest services exporter in the world, moving up the ladder by two positions. Emphasizing that India had the potential to become the top services exporter in the world, Goyal said that the services sector is boosting India's transition from an assembly economy to a knowledge-based economy. The minister also highlighted the need for assisting states in formulating a comprehensive export strategy with districts as export hubs. Delhi Regional Security Dialogue, which is being convened by India over the Afghanistan situation, will be held in New Delhi today. The dialogue will be held at the level of National Security Advisors or Secretaries of Security Councils and will be chaired by India's National Security Advisor, Ajit Doval. The dialogue will witness the participation of Iran, Kazakhstan, Kyrgyz Republic, Russia, Tajikistan, Turkmenistan and Uzbekistan. India had also invited Pakistan and China for the meeting. However, both countries are not participating. This is the first time all Central Asian countries, not just Afghanistan's immediate land neighbours, are participating in this format. The enthusiastic response is recognition of the importance attached to India's role to promote peace and security in Afghanistan. Union Minister of State in the Prime Minister's Office and MOS for Earth Sciences, Science and Technology, as well as Personal Public Grievances and Pensions, Dr. Jitendra Singh said that since the formation of Modi government in 2014, Prime Minister Narendra Modi has emphasised the development of the Northeast region. He said Modi has a vision to bring the northeastern states at par with the most developed states in western India like Gujarat and Maharashtra. He said that two years ago, the Union government brought an amendment in the Northeast Council Act that the deprived and neglected section of the society will get special attention and special grants. India's COVID vaccination coverage has crossed 109 crores, 59 lakh mark. Out of the total vaccination, more than 74 crores, 36 lakh vaccine doses have been given as first dose, while over 35 crores, 23 lakh doses have been administered as the second dose. The Union Health Ministry said that more than 48 lakh, 39,000 vaccine doses were administered till 7pm yesterday. As part of the nationwide vaccination drive, the centre has been supporting the states and union territories by providing them COVID vaccines free of cost. As India achieved the milestone of vaccinating 100 crore people against COVID-19, All India Radio salutes all the people, doctors, nurses and others who made this possible. Even though the country has achieved this feat, we caution our listeners that the battle against COVID is not yet over. We appeal to our listeners who are yet to fully get vaccinated to get vaccinated at the earliest and also help others to get vaccinated. During the festival season, please follow these three simple steps. Wear a face mask, maintain six feet for social distancing, focus on hand and face hygiene. For any COVID-related information and guidance, contact National Helpline numbers 011-2397-8046 and 1075 and state help and number one is zero zero three four five zero zero one nine. With that we come to the end of the morning news. Have a nice day.